So we are in back to school season. A new study finds that more than a million students drop out of high school every year. Trying to help prevent this, the country's first African-American intercollegiate Greek letter fraternity has a program that helps students get their diploma and then head off to college. This morning, Kali Richardson and Jermaine Patterson from Alpha Phi Alpha are for Let's talk about this. It's the go to high school, go to college program. Well, that's our national initiative. Actually, this is our centennial year with that program. Back in uh, 1919, the organization launched a movement to focus on education. And we targeted, uh, at that time, elementary students and high school students with promoting education. Mm -hmm. Okay, And it, it, it was a focus on all colleges throughout the nation, uh, pl placing a focus on uh, emphasizing education for, for students. Because right. at that time, as you stated, it was a... Uh, um, uh, 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 an area where there was a high need, mm -hmm. okay? And that continued throughout the centuries, throughout the years. And we are here today where Brother uh, Richardson is gonna talk about what we're doing. Yeah, and yes. what you're doing here with this program now locally. Yeah, so now uh, the state of Florida actually did a cohort study that's about a 4% dropout rate across that has that million that you were talking about. Wow. And within here in Orange County, it's about 1.4, but when we're looking back at the diaspora of African-American students, primarily males, it's 6.4. So what we do to take that national program and make it more of a local program is what we call Young Men of Distinction, YMOD. And so we target middle school, high school students, help them transition from middle school to high school, high school to college, and mm -hmm. assist in giving them scholarship funds, tools and resources, mentoring, soft skills, leadership, and just camaraderie amongst each other. So they have friends not only in their schools, but across the city. And, and what do you do, how do you get somebody who's already on the path, they're thinking about going to college, they want to keep it going, but how do you keep them in that, in that right frame of mind that they're still focusing on the studies, they're focusing on that camaraderie? Well, a little bit what we all mentioned, point oh student, right? Mm -hmm. Full academic scholarship, great young man. The biggest thing is that camaraderie. So putting him around his peers that have simple ideals that he has, mm -hmm. have them just do soft skills, like we'll do paintball for team building, right? Yeah. Just having fun and just letting them know that once you leave this program, then we can have a different conversation. I just recently graduated with my master's, so I'm, I can still give them that college perspective. Mm -hmm. And so we just build those relationships. And even now we have students that are at Valencia College here in the city that come back and talk to us and say, hey, I have some questions that I know you mentioned it before, but can you brush me up a little bit? Right, right. right. So you just yeah. keep, it's sort of a circle. Yes, mm -hmm. and, and, and with our program, we want to focus on their academic development. So while we have specific focus, we have four pillars, academic development, social development, leadership development, and personal development. So while they're in our program, we're also honing in on those skills so that when they uh, post high school, they can be successful. Absolutely. Jermaine, health for being here. It's a wonderful program that you guys have. We wish you the best of luck. Come through the program to come back and, and fulfill that with you guys as yeah. well. Thank